Um, I starting that um again. <laughs> Things I do to prep. Uh, so right now, uh, but constantly. I mean, literally constantly again. Emergency emails about this snowstorm. Uh, nothing big. Um, I mean, we got what, um, is it, got, you know, I think like 10 inches of snow. Um, I could be wrong. Um, I know it was helping pretty high, but, um, nothing major. But I have been, um, preparing for power power outage and loss of heat which you can hear the heater no not the heater but the furnace I don't know if you can hear it but it's running um, and the third reason why I moved my big uh, toolbox scrub kit Upstairs, um, instead of um, in the basement, if you didn't know this toolbox, Stanley toolbox, um, which I love very much. Um, I moved it upstairs because our basement uh, is only good for one thing, and that is tornadoes. Um, nothing is nothing that I own is um, good to stay down there. Um, I guess for example, I haven't been cleaning this toolbox now. Um, real organizing and stuff. So there's not much in here except for a um, little knife. Um, six volt battery and my lantern. Call it a floating lantern. I actually use this quite a lot uh, when I have to do outside work. What I mean outside work is um, uh, security, uh, safety reasons. Uh, I'm not going to go in detail. Um, we have safety protocols here. Um, and well, there's a particular door that sometimes opens by itself, doesn't want to lock sometimes, but uh, if you lock it, uh, you have to walk around and check if it's really locked. So, um, and when it gets cold like this, uh, the wind blowing, it sometimes it unlocks, but this is the flush that I choose. Uh, Got three LEDs, it's not that bright, but uh, I love it. Uh, actually, uh, funny story about this flashlight. Uh, when I went to get this flashlight, uh, I wasn't planning on getting it. My stepdad gave me a gift card. Uh, it was it five bucks, I think? It had like, like $6.50 on it. A gift card that he had told me you got um, what was it, 30 seconds to find something to spend that $6.17 on or whatever the price was, but um, I saw this and grabbed it because um, I see it all the time and at Home Depot and I always wanted to pick one up, I always wanted to own one, uh, love it, uh, wish it was brighter though. I'm gonna keep that in this toolbox. I can lift you up and show you. And that's what I keep in there. Blanket. It's not the best blanket. Sorry, I'm trying to re reposition you. It's not the best blanket out there. Um, it's just a small blanket. That original blanket was to keep things insulated in this toolbox because our basement 
it's very cold, which is very bad on batteries, um, which I have run into. That's why all my batteries are upstairs, warm area. Um, we can get this in a minute. That's where I keep most of my prepping stuff. Um, but this is um, this toolbox is going to progress um, to something bigger um, when I find the time. But as you know, uh, as I said, this has turned into many things. Um, as of right now. It's holding my um, hmm. sorry. It, it had a piece of food before I had started. It had a flash lights there. They're not LED, but some of them are LED, some are not. Um, this is a military light. I like this. Um, pretty cool flashlight. Um, it has its issues, but Pretty cool. Um, as I said, um, some of these are LED. I have this duct tape around it because I don't like the texture. Um, all these flashlights that are in here are, um, except for one, just my um, Bushnell headlamp it is um, low power. That's what I carry where these as low power flashlights. Basically, that means um, they're not super bright or super. Uh, they're not the best. They're not fucking bright. Um, I also have a box of matches in here. Um, um, the three pack box of matches. Yeah. yeah. I'm working on getting um, tea, I think it's called tea lights, I don't know. But as I said, um, I'm moving things around. So for example, like, hey, maybe I want to put this stuff in here. Keep my low power stuff in here. The matches. Oh. And of course, my D battery. My um, not D battery. Uh, 6 volt. In there. Which is very preferably. Feels nicely. Of course, I didn't get that on camera. Feels nicely. Now, I'm gonna use this handle can. This is the toolbox. Toolbox, not tool chest. Kind of a mess in there. It looks like a mess, but it's not. These are MREs. These are the accessories from previous MREs I keep in here. Um, call these my bargain, bargain tools. Um, I really can't name anything that's in here. Um, so this one doesn't have any stickers on it. So this one is batteries. Um, you got double A, D batteries, triple A's. Um, like I said, I'm working on restoring my battery. Uh, 
batteries I need to get more of is double A's. I have so many, no, why did I say double A's? I mean triple A's. I have so many double A's. Um, <laughs> that, that container doesn't hold all my double A's. Down here is my first aid kit. No, I'm not. This is my first aid kit. I forgot that I like to keep it on top. This is my battery one. Up here is just random storage. Uh, I got a CB radio over here that doesn't really work. I don't got parts for it. Um, but I have this big empty area. It's just got random stuff in it that don't work. Like this. Broken. Um, you know, it's stuff I don't use. So my basically my plan was to put this Toolbox fits in there. Um, it's not even, I know. I know it's not even. Um, I don't label things because I know what they are. So MREs, first aid kit, batteries, um, extra storage. Um, Um, psh, I forgot the word. No. Low power flashlights. Um, basically, this is my storm, storm gear. All, all this is or whatever. And he, yes, I know this MRE opening. Um, I did have this one. This one was this uh, pork sausage patty. Uh, it wasn't that great. Uh, Everything else is sealed. I think this is a chocolate chip cookie. Uh, I done my research. It, it looks like it's not up there. What? Yes. Um, everything is sealed, so it's fine. Uh, how it is. Peroxide, um, fun tip, peroxide does not work well on its side, it tends to leak, um, that's why it's not in my first aid kit, um, and, uh, my bandana, um, they see what's up here, it eyes and ends. Um, that's my prepping stuff, um, odds and ends, goods, and storm prep, um, these are two different 50 cal uh, containers, fun fact, I didn't know that <coughs> in a grocery store, you can't call them 50 cal, um, or ammo cans, you can't call them that. You have to call them utility cans. Um, I, I have nothing to support that. Um, I, I refuse to do research on that. The only one that said it was an ammo can was this one right here. Um, because I got it at Harbor Freight. That one I got at Myers. Myers, that was before Myers switched over to plastic. Uh, they now have plastic ones. And every so often they will have metal ones. But it's mostly plastic in my area. I don't know about your area. But they're called utility cans. Um, makes me 
Makes it sound like a toilet or something. I'm looking, I'm looking on the camera, see if there's anything else I need to talk about. Um, I do have more flashlights. I always have flashlights. I have so many flashlights. Uh, things I have a lot of flashlights, batteries, knives. Uh, I won't tell you all of them. <laughs> I keep some secret, secret, you know. My flashlights are spread all around the place, so they're all in one place. And like I said, my one video, um, I don't know what the video is. I might show you guys on video what one thing is, but once that video goes away, it moves. Something I learned. Once you show something on camera, it moves. I just put it back how it is before I turn on the camera. <laughs> so this stuff is always changing. Always. Um, sorry, didn't mean to get like scare you guys. Talk to you later.